He's going to be the analyst for this game? That I did not know. He texted me last week and said, hey, I'm going to be doing some games, but he didn't tell me it was going to be this game. Yeah, you guys were shocked. That was news, too. That would be awesome. The weather's getting cold, so he's probably not playing as much golf. Coach has, obviously, a tremendous mind and uh, has an eye for the game and can see things, so that's that's pretty cool. Coach Cutter uh, has been a, a mentor of mine for a long time. We were in contact a lot, uh, really, over the last three, four years. Um, at one point, thought his son was maybe going to come to Missouri, and so... I do talk to him, you know, once a week, and uh, he's just a, a really, really great resource uh, and somebody who, who I trust a lot. I mean, he'll shoot some text messages and pop in when he is uh, here in Boise. Uh, so it's uh, it's good to see him. I'm glad he's keeping busy. He's an extremely hard worker and he's got a, a tremendous mind. So it's not shocking that you know for him to continue to be a part of the game. One year after calling plays for Boise State, Dirt Cutter will now be calling games for FS1. The reaction you heard from both Andy Avalos and Bush Hamden was completely genuine. At the weekly press conference back on Monday, we all found out about Dirk's newest hobby together. Now, as far as the game goes, I messaged Dirk, and he said that he auditioned for this role earlier in the summer, and finally FS1 gave him a call. As far as a pregame interview, Dirk said that he just wanted to keep it about the guys on the field and push the attention there.